Not a good, not a good shot. Fades in. Time to go. Like proper go. Whoa, there we go, folks. All right, let's. That sounds like a feral. Sure is. Yeah, they definitely didn't like my vehicle. Come on! Yes! Yeah, we'll take some of that. Kia ora, kia ora, hi to my greetings and welcome. I am Guru. We are back in Trucker County with the Fortress playing the No Man's Land mod. And as the moon sinks below the horizon, we have got an urgent job to do, which is to get up here and clear this outpost so that we get four extra food and from there we'll we'll come up with a uh, a further strategy for how we're going to continue the war against the play carts and the undead scourge probably that's going to involve some trading because we have zero stims and we definitely need sims to take on play carts but we're off in possibly one of the world's slowest cars but it's all we got so let's go, let's go, let's hope that we're there in time. We've got a couple of fuel bombs if it comes to it. I mean, it's not the end of the world if we don't get there in time, but I mean, who who would not do this for food, for food, right? And then we might stick an outpost on there. Because this is supposed to be our outpost for going further south and taking on more plague hearts in... Uh, in and around the area where we, uh, round, round the truck stop. You know the place. You know the place. I've been there loads. Let's just get straight in there. There we go. Job done. Alright, let's just make sure that they're all, they're all dead as they should be. Not a bad throw. If I do say so myself. Out of a little pinnacles. Okay, here we go. Lovely. Alright, so here's the score, folks. Here's the score. We're probably about to be sieged. Which means we should probably head down here and do as much trading as we can do as we move back up towards where we're obviously going to get sieged. And then we might do some more trading with these other enclaves and uh, hope that we get some stims. On top of that, we also have 1600 influence. So why don't we call in some other survivors? And we'll just keep doing that. They will be cogs in my economy. Uh, do we need a fuel, a gas can? It's possible. Right now, with uh, this, let's um, let's do that because with it all up, that's plus three per day. Otherwise, we're losing food per day. We don't want to do that. We'll just check the gas can situation. Yeah, we could chuck that in, couldn't we? And possibly see what else we've got to sell. Thank you for joining. Welcome to the party. <laughs> we uh, jumped in straight away and uh, yeah, not a lot of time for pleasantries. Wherever you are in the world, I hope you're doing well. I'm going to chuck another fuel can in because we should. Um, now, I notice we've got two bolt crafting kits. We don't need two of those. I mean, we don't really... Well, we do need the influence because um, we want to buy as many um, stims as we possibly can. Having said that, we don't really have a lot of really good stuff to sell. I um, mean, we've got some books and stuff. But we like all of this stuff. We want to keep all of it. Yep, we want to keep all of it. There we go, plus five food. So... Save the day. Down two materials. So Jenny and the Unbound have turned up on the map. Excellent. Let's see where they are. Hopefully they're somewhere close. Jenny and the... Uh, is that them? No, that's the Blood Sisters. We could go help them. Oh, oh, they're right down there. That is pretty handy. Shall we go see them? 
We don't really need to go see them. But we will. It's not like we get any influence for it, but it would be interesting just to check them out and see what they're about. My curiosity is getting the better of me. If there's just too many zombies, we'll bugger off. Because, you know, we don't need to... We don't need to risk anything for this kind of uh, activity. Like that's that's quite a quite a lot of them. Besides, this is kind of like the territory that we want to get into. Oh, does he yelled straight away? You jerk! All right, well, that didn't work out. Oh, they're just screaming and all kinds of carry on. Yeah. This is a little lost course. Oh, and a juggernaut. <laughs> okay. All right. That's how it works. I wanted to meet some people. I wanted to talk to them. Nope. Not happening. Lose two doors and call me in the morning. Freaking heck. All right. Um, but I did just see that on players have uh, new items to sell to sell so let's see what they're about um all right Let's grab our stuff and sell it. Big spenders, that's us. Well, we will be big spenders. So, Scotty. Let's get down to business. Yeah. What do you got for us? It's got a stem. I got better. Keep the alternative. Sure does. Let's just make sure that everyone's hunky dory, right? Sunny could go in. Um sunny, sunny, sunny. All right, so then we just roll up the road. Continually trading. As fast as we can trade and get stims, the faster that we can uh, use them. Assaulting play cards. Now these, this enclave up here should have a lot, a much easier time these days, seeing as we took out a play cart down near the corner. Where we just came from. Let's make a deal. Have that, and you can sell us. Plague here, and we're, I think we're okay for parts. 372, and we've got quite a lot in our locker, so, and we've got a salvage furnace. So we're okay, we don't really need to trade for that. Which is good. We'll whack those in there so we don't use them by accident. So you see, if we tr can, like, get one from each of these... So we one, two, three, four, five, six stims. And that's enough for another play card. Massive amounts of play cards on this map. 76 originally. I think we're down to the last oh, 50, maybe. We'll check in a sec. To be honest, I haven't looked in a long time because, you know, it's been a high number. As you well have known if you've been watching the series. Oh boy. Just take these guys out quickly. Ah, oh, he saw us. Oh, 
Uh, they will get themselves killed, so we'll just move on. We'll be back. Yeah, there weren't two of them. There are four of them. Okay, next guys are up here in the red house. Now, these guys are fantastic shots. So we're not too worried about them. Yeah, listen to that. Boom. So, oh, he's got a BAR, that's why. Still, we'll give him a hand. Not that it's required. That, my friends, is why if you find a BAR, give it to one of your guys at your base. And you'll be sorted. Um, no stims, but they do have a bottle of strong painkillers. So we have got a few of those. But we've also got plenty of influence. So we'll spend it. Move on to the next place. And then we'll probably switch over vehicles once we get back to base so that we can do our trading a little quicker. Get around the map a bit faster. Our situation we could probably do with some more crossbow bolts to be honest hey you hey there, business partner mm. yeah, sure. look back teams are good oh, I think we're okay take another strong painkiller I have another task for you details forthcoming okay details forthcoming Could be a possibility. All right, here we go. Okay. So, let's look. We've got... Aha! Well under 50. We've got 41 play cards left. Too easy. And the Mysterious Broadcast is where? That's actually pretty close. But we'll still head down this way and we'll complete our trades. Might even see if we can help these guys. We'll give it a go. Um, I think what we'll do is... we have an outpost down there? I don't think we do. We don't. Okay, for now. Doesn't make that much difference, I don't think, but we'll just take... We'll get 30 light bolts. I think if I've got the bolt crafting kit in there, I get I get some a few more, but this should be enough for us to get by on. Trying to, trying to keep the ball rolling, you know? Right. Here's our baby. And Brogan Sport costs a lot to run. But it's fast. So it's pretty much perfect for what we need. We don't have to worry too much about, you know, not having enough influence because we've only got a targeted number of items that we want to get. Really, it's just stims, strong painkillers, um, C4, stuff like that. We can make our own C4, actually. That's a good point. I don't think we put a gas can in the back, so... 
I hope they've got one to sell. It's not us, it's the next one. Don't want to get too close because this community, this enclave, has taken a bit of a beating, to be honest. Nothing here. Surprise. A circle of truth. Circle of truth. Circle of safety. Circle of Trust, that's the one. Alright. You. you got something for me? Yeah, why not? Brilliant. Everything that we wanted. Everything that we wanted. Oops. Good shot, Guru. Do us a favor next time and just uh, don't. All right, we are still pressing on that. Yeah, the good times roll. Wee. Okay. Now, it's a little bit out of our way, but these other two enclaves have generally been pretty good for trading. Particularly the one in the pharmacy. They've always had stims, and we haven't been there for a while, so... I'm hoping they've built up a little bit. If we can get two or three, that would be great. Imagine if we got back with like eight or nine stims. Wow, that would be just amazing. We'd be well ready. Start moving in on the new patch. That would be a real trial by fire for, the, for that new uh, enclave, I tell you. Okay. Two monitors. Pretty handy, actually. Uh, it's not that great. We'll, we'll take him. We're always using gas. Oops. Onwards. Wow, it's been a while since we've been down this end of town. We'll hold up here for a long time in the uh, night's family in turned out to be a pretty good base actually particularly for the stage of the game that we we're at definitely good up tight. Hey there, stranger. Let's make a deal. hello okay. boom there we go two of those uh yeah we can stack them would like that too so we've got 25. We're okay. We're okay. Yeah, All right, now there's one more enclave. Oh, shall we? Shall we see if we can help these guys? We're down here. We'll give it a go. It's a nightmarish part of the map to be on. 
We should probably park some distance away. And see if we can move in. Because it's, you know, it's... Yeah. Those. Out for blood zombies. They're just crazy. Exactly, come with a lot of stuff. Is he screaming? Are these guys like permanently aggroed? Is that what's going on here? Did anyone else see that? Alright guys, I'm ready to get back in the game. Yeah, this is shit. We're out of here. Except they're faster than me. What if we're going to leave them down there? We might as well go for it. So tired. Get thee from me. I mean, even if I trigger the mission and they all get wiped out, then at least I don't have to worry about it anymore. Jeepers creepers, can you imagine what this is going to be like when I go and try and take out a play cart with these guys around? It's going to be an absolute killer. Let's make a deal. Might as well. Is that it? You guys suck. What do we need to do? Talk to Daryl. It's Daryl. insane holy crap this is unreasonable what Yeah, I knew there was a reason I didn't do this. Tell you what, we might be safer in a vehicle. There's a bloater. We're not going to park like that, though.
Maybe we could learn a little bit about how to fight these guys. Don't miss. Alright, Daryl, where are you? You're not Daryl. Nessus, Doug, Daryl. Okay. something for me why not so where do they want me to go up the road and back we could do that I would like to get rid of this mission because it's kind of been holding things up a little bit been a distraction <sighs> Joey's hardware should be doable Right. get in and out of here without causing a fracas that would be a bonus that's what i was looking for Very yelly, these zombies. Very yelly. More yelly than my cat, and that's hard to do. Actually, I'm not sure they are more yelly than my cat. So last time parking further away and trying to creep in did not work at all. And certainly not as well as actually just driving up to the house. And parking under the window. Here you go. Hey, 
but they have more stuff to trade? Let's find out. Daryl? Hello, my friend. Let's get down to business. Okay, sure. Nope. 200 influence. That's it. And now we don't have the sanitation machine. Alright. We'll check in on our last enclave. Fill the car up with gas. And then we'll get back and load up and target it hard. Yeah, that out for blood is going to be a killer. Has me thinking, would I actually break my nerve and use a uh, rig? Um, go as far as shit. We better get going. Go as far as using scent block. Oosh! It's been a long time. Let's get down to business. Okay. Oh, that really sucks. It's a bit shit. We'll take those. All right. Let's get going. Looks like nobody else is home. Yeah, th those guys down there have been pretty bad from the get-go, eh? Gotta kill that screamer. Doom, 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 doom. this way back. Probably straight ahead, right? Let's go. Wow. Two massive hordes. If I plow through one of those, I'd need to repair the vehicle, and I'm not sure I've got a toolkit. need to take a few shortcuts here which I don't usually like doing in a light vehicle because they can flip so easily and if I flip the car through my own stupidity not a graphics glitch that's it I have to get a uh, another follower or a helper from somewhere either an enclave or from my base so that it's two of us and then we can flip the vehicle no auto riding but I have been guilty of forgetting that from time to time. I'm better these days, though. Alright, wonder what the siege is going to be like. Not exactly armed for it ourselves but we'll get we'll get in the base quick and get ourselves some fire get ourselves some nades put a couple mollies in there that that's it's kind of like the perfect thing for them you know don't always want to use your best fire for every situation for example a molotov will clear out an infestation almost as good as a fuel bomb all you want to do is take out the scream and then the molly is fine you know so you don't always have to get the best stuff. Horses for courses. Tools for the job. And other cliches. Hmm. We are... 
see what we've got in the way of ammo. I've got one of those. And we did take a fair few scratches, didn't we? Molly's. Got any pipe bombs? Any nades? Just that. Don't have a lot of bullets, really, do we? Okay, where are these guys coming in from the south? Get the armors as they come over. If it gets out of hand, we'll run and get a. What? What? What's all the what? What the heck? Why am I getting all these penalties? I'm out there butchering them. Ah, bollocks. That's annoying. What, did I actually have to select Siege? I have selected Siege. And they're still coming. Alright, I suppose I have to stand inside my base. Get interesting. Yeah, we might need to make some actually. Maybe I took too long to get back to base. Maybe that was it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wow, we've been doing that little maneuver a lot. Not a good shot. Any of these local places of oh, the police department is an infestation, but we don't really care about that. All right. Well, we lost a bit of stuff, which was a bit unfortunate. I don't know how that worked. But I guess it. We survived a siege. Hmm. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get ourselves back in the game. So, I guess we, oh, we could head up there. Yeah, we'll head on up there. All of you, I think, I think we want to take these on. Start taking these guys on. So we'll, we'll tool up. We'll take out this area. And we'll take, shall we take Isaac? Isaac's great. In, oh, it's going to be endurance. Yeah, we'll take Isaac. And then we'll kit up at the outpost to attack a uh, to attack a play cart. But it would make sense to do the mysterious. Oh, did we get a mysterious wandering trader or something? Wandering trader, spare parts. Hmm. Not sure what you get for spare parts, but um. Right. So the first part. Of his mission is quiet ish, or should be quiet ish. Um, ammo, please. Wow, we're down to 18 already. That did not last long. All right, we got some stuff to put away. And we'll take our truck. It's gas cans, got bats. It's got the driver's door on, so it's good enough for the task at hand. Shadow starting to get a little bit longer. Moving on into the afternoon. Whether it'll still be daylight by the time we go in a, on the play card or not, I'm not too sure. I mean, we spent a lot of those crossbow bolts doing that mission for the uh, sisters or whatever they're called. This is below the uh, Feral Central last time. What's up here? Oh, yeah, there's a nasty old horde. Feral on its way. Just the one, hopefully. Just the one. But loads of friends. All 
right. Down the road. Excuse me. Committed survivors freak in the house. Possibly. Who are the committed survivors? They do not sound familiar to me. Not the people we just helped. Oh, them. Dang it. We do have to do that. That's so annoying. Um... Right. Well, we'll do that. We'll just check out our shotgun shell situation first. Make sure that we've got ammo for the job at hand when it comes to this play card. 77. Yep, we're all good. Could do with some more 22, though, couldn't we? But we do have the scorpion. That's right. I think I bought that especially. Here's what I found while I was out scavenging. Yeah. All right, better go help these guys. All right. Hope you realize how inconvenient this is. I didn't really want to go in on those clustered play carts in the middle of the night. But we might have to. At least test them out. Conservative recon and force, you know? See if we can do some damage, see if we can avoid spending lots of resources. See if we can get out alive. Don't have to kill it in one go. Now I've had to learn that the hard way. Oh, come on. They got it. Find him. Just gotta keep this up a little longer. Steady on. Jeepers, creepers. Looks, looks like you've got guests. I'm not sure you want me to hang around. What up? What up? I think we can help each other out. Oh, sounds good. Now they've got anything new? They do not. All right. Cost me a bit more in terms of resources, but they are now safe and happy. After all, they're giving me off-site fuel storage, and I can't afford to lose that. Ugh. They're more there just for, you know, close trading and being a nuisance to the zombies. Been a nuisance to me, more like. So we're, there we go. Crafted some ammo, and we just put a backpack in. So, rucksack of ammo, so we should be alright for ammo. Let's 
speaking of ammo, maybe we can make some C4 or something. I think we can make remote mines, but I don't think we've got the, uh, the skills to do any more than that. Let's have a look. We're crafting C4 electronics, so we don't have that. We do have remote box mines, and that would give us six, which is quite a lot. How many have we got at the moment? None. Or we could go with bloated gas grenades. Hmm. Let's get our food going. Right. Um, yeah, and more more of that. Okay, we'll scoot down the road and we'll collect our supply drop because we should get some crossbow bolts out of that. Maybe a few other goodies and then we'll come back and we'll tool up. We'll go down and we'll... Maybe we'll try talking to the... Uh, talking to that enclave again. And some pretty rugged terrain. Let's look to us. Now, what are we going to get? Company. There we go, crossbow bolts. Nice. So we'll drop this stuff back and we'll uh, we'll tool up. Oh, we were going to try and talk to those people, weren't we? See, yeah, yeah. We'll drop the stuff off then. I mean, I heard them shooting guns, but it'd be good to know what kind of guns they got. I don't remember hearing any high-capacity, high-caliber magazines or anything. It sounded pretty basic. We can do both. We can do both. Eat all mallet. Nice. Echo 3 shotgun. Scorpion. The infestations around here have gone critical. It may be too late to avoid a siege. Yeah, we'll be fine. Those that. Probably do us. Let's go.
Here we go, folks. Here we go. Nasty at night, I tell you that. And Isaac isn't exactly our toughest warrior, but he needs to he needs to train up. So. these guys there's one hello there got anything useful you're looking to unload I got grenades we've got 22 all right let's go see what these guys are about that is bad so just you hopefully not Okay, we might need to flambe some of these people. Oh no, they've found someone to distract them. Right, that'll keep them busy. Okay, time for a close encounter. We're gonna wake up some play cats, but that's just the way it goes. Now that's where the pump action shotguns come in really 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 good ow not only do they never break but you can re uh, fire them mid reload all right we need to stay on this do some damage Other enclave. That enclave, I think, is turning out to be quite the distraction. So if they scream like that. Shit, where did he come from? Poison! That's not good. I ah, see, they must be hanging out on the roof. Oh, 
distract them. Might have to throw another one. comes sounds like another one Get out. Killed quite a few infestation ferals. Keep on it. And then we'll be out of stand pretty much, so we'll have to get on out. Hmm. getting away with this. Alright. That's it. Now it's time to make a run for it. Oops. Nice. Happy with that. Didn't exactly take get two phases out of it. There was just the one phase, but not a bad start. Okay. Oh, uh, give him a break. Nice one, Isaac. And we will send in Liz. So Descending in layers. Oh, yeah, we want to turn that on. For sure, it is. It's better. Um, because he's got powerhouse, and I am starting to warm towards the concept of using the uh, the power swing. 
And you might say, of course use the power swing. But when, when you're being absolutely overrun by zombies, it's not that easy. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but it does look like we, uh, we are making some progress. So let's grab that. Let's grab Echo 3. Some ammo. Uh, some fire. And some snacks. Better not have to run carrying all this. A snack. Okay, well. Point four. There we go. Perfect. Oh, what condition is our beetle hammer in? Oh, it's in good shape. That's in good shape. Everything's in good shape. Except the vehicle. It's not in good shape. But it's a utility truck, and they're hard to kill. Hopefully this enclave of ours is hard to kill as well, because they're doing a fine job. Oh my word. Feral that can't miss. Cheapskate. Phasing. Oh, 
I'm hoping that the heart will drag them in away from me and with a few well-placed fuel bombs we might be able to finish this one off Juggernaut's quite good at distracting and tracking me down. Alright, it's probably good now. Gun out. All going wrong. Alright, now we got it. There we go. Oh. Now we can start claiming nearby places for ourselves. I saw the bloater. Oh shit, another one. I saw the bloater and I managed to stop myself shooting it. But it nearly very, very, very nearly went horribly, horribly wrong. Because there just happened to be a juggernaut at the doorway that I managed to squeeze past. But then there was another one out there, plus a feral pack. They're all building up for something special, that's for sure. Alright. Well, that's another one down. Nice. Alright, they want materials. Uh, yeah, we'll give them materials, for sure. Which means we have to go back to base. Which I'm quite happy to do. All right, Al. Got job done. Hey there. We've got an offer for you. If wow. You like they are... Missions are coming out thick and fast. I think we want an allied enclave more than we want to help a lone survivor. And we do have the materials in order to do so. I think we'll have about 17 or something, so rucksack's what, four or five? Five, I think. Yeah, we're definitely not going back down to that place without a utility truck. And seeing as there's jugs down, juggernauts down there as well, we might... Uh, Yeah, we might just repair it first. And this is not the time to be taking any great risks. All right, we're going on a little bit. That's right. I do want to on. And um, what we'll do. Actually, we don't need both of those. We'll get down there. We'll give the um, materials over. And loot the play cart. Nah, we're fine. People are keeping you alive, bro. No. We got a 
Whoops. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Um, okay, 47. Yes. Ha, ah, that was without primary care as well. And infection therapy. Yep, we'll do that. Just make sure we're all hunky dory here. Yep. We are good. All right, we'll swap out. And also want to say, we'll grab Josh. I don't think I'm gonna get better without help. Been running around without a melee weapon. How did I do that? Um, we will take. Sawn off. Okay, we'll take those. Some snacks. Crossbow bolts. Some ammo. Don't need that much though. That's enough to keep us out of trouble. And... Take them a note. Right, and... Where's our... Storage? Up the front, isn't it? And we will take out materials five. Okay, that's not too bad. It'll be worth it, because these guys will have... Play cart supplies or something. Mark my words. Speak with Elizabeth. Just out of interest. How many remain? Two. You might be throwing good materials after a bad investment, but it really depends on the bonus I get. I'm not sure if, like, for plague heart supplies, which give you things like, they give you amazing stuff <laughs> in terms of bonuses, um, or plague heart supply drops, you know, they give you awesome stuff. Whether that's tied to any particular enclave, whether it's a special one or not, I've only had it once or twice. One time I got it and I lost it really really quickly because they wanted to accompany me and attack a play cart and they died while doing it and that was it i lost the enclave so that that wasn't great did i might as well just put that on our backs now Oh, I must, uh, yeah, I've been a little bit under the weather. I must need a bit of a lie down, to be honest. I'm starting to forget things that I did two seconds ago. Right, we'll, we'll push on just these next few minutes. Get our just rewards for all the hard effort that we put in. Hopefully we'll get some stims. Oh, that's one of them. Undignified. You think they're up the ladder? Stands. Damn, this shit is heavy. Oh, we'll take that. We'll go up the ladder because I think we can actually... Oh! Who's that? Oops, sorry. That's them. Which one's Elizabeth? You! 
You there. But if they're up there, they're like snipers. I knew there was some way of destroying the ladder so they couldn't get down. Rooftop sniper. Okay, I've heard that that's not the worst and worst thing in the world, okay? Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to drop that. I can't be bastard with it. Um, as long as that plague guard's around, this place ain't ever going to feel safe. Oof. Listen to it. Feel. Back in the day when the uh, play cart was, you know, the sorry, the bloater was making those noises and they kept making them. I actually thought that that was a plane flying overhead. They don't want to live, do they? Alright. Um, we're just going to get out of here. Maybe you shouldn't have taken on the hundred zombies. Half. Yeah, a rooftop sniper's not, not going to hang around for that long, I, I don't think. If they were actually inside, like, a proper building and weren't, roll, you know, running down, sliding down ladders and stuff, might have had a shot. Still, it was worth it. If they had had play cart supplies or something, I would have gone there and down there well-armed, because there was no way I would be risking losing those, losing that Enclave bonus if they had play carts supply drops. I just keep hoping that one day we'll get it again. Look at that. And that gives us four, I think? Which is enough. It's enough to get by. Alright. Next job will be that play cart. That play cart. Then that play cart. Then we should be able to loot this whole area. Taking that out should take out the... Oh, it's a little... Yeah. Taking out those play carts should eliminate that level 3 infestation as well. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Cool. Well, we are making progress. Making progress. All right, we'll call the episode there and we'll move on uh, next week and see how we get on. Thank you so much for watching. Looks like the moon is going to... Yeah, it's still a bit of night to go. But that's all right. We'll keep, uh, we'll keep at it. I mean, last time we did pretty well. We'll keep at it. All right. Thank you so much for watching wherever you are in the world. Go in peace. Thank you for all your support. And I hope you're enjoying the series. Till next time. Hope to see you there. Kakite. Bye for now.